My name is AJ Ade, and I'm from Fort Hood, Texas. My family's from Ghana, but I live in Boston, Massachusetts. I always make sure to surround myself with a lot of black friends because um, my freshman and sophomore year of high school, I lived in North Carolina. So I lived in the South, like I've always lived in Texas. And we had 33 black people in the entire school. And so just living in that environment made me realize that I needed more people like that looked like me. I needed more mentors that looked like me because our experience isn't the same as other people in this country. So I wanted to help achieve my dreams in the sense of going about with people that have the same experience as I do. Of course, when I was little, growing up with an identity was an important thing. And identity is important for every single person. And so trying to develop an identity based off those two overlaps that I have in my life became very difficult until I realized that I just had to let it flow all at once. I'm never going to fit into only the African box, and I'm never going to fit into only the American box. So I have to understand that the intersection of those two is where my identity lies. And that's really helped me. Girls are so put under the influence to be perfect, especially black women. They have to defy a lot of standards, unfair standards that are placed upon them. And that just that goes for how you work in the business area, how you work in how you look, how you talk, how you write, everything. Because if it's not a 10 out of 10 on every single scale, then you're inadequate. But I recently realized that I'm under no obligation to be beautiful physically. I'm under no obligation to be finished at the age of 17 with developing. And I'm no, under no obligation to be perfect for someone else.